Hey guys, welcome back. We're going to deploy a brain cancer uh, web app to predict whether something is a tumor or a healthy brain. Remember that previous video we did where we trained the convolutional neural network to predict brain cancer or not with that same data set on Kaggle? Well, if you guys saw that video, here's one thing you can do. If you guys save the uh, model as an H5 file. We're going to use Streamlit, if, uh, and then we're going to deploy it on Streamlit Cloud. Okay, so import these necessary libraries. There's your title, your header, and then the text above, uh, let me show you. Right here. Okay. Uh, I already deployed it, uh, but... And I deployed it before on Render, but they don't support Streamlit Framework. That's where I was going to do my tutorial. And I deployed it on DigitalOcean, but that's a little expensive. So I decided something free. Streamlit Cloud. Streamlit Share, technically. Okay, so uh, your uploaded file, as you can see. And then, uh, label 0, remember from the data set, that is your... Um, positive label actually which means tumor and if it's not a zero it's a healthy brain okay so we're gonna go to your other page remember there's your model file requirements text I uh, you can deploy you can't deploy it on Heroku most likely because it's uh, I tried it and the slug size was too big. Okay, and then uh, pay attention right here. Um, the app. Uh, also, you want to copy and paste this whenever you want to deploy something on Streamlit, your app file. I'll show you one in a second. Okay, your image classification, TY. Import these libraries, your weights file. And then 384, 384. Remember the input shapes? Same thing right there. And then MPArgmax to compute the prediction. Okay. There you guys go. Now, I'll walk you through kind of how to do it. It takes a while to deploy, so... Okay, after you created your Streamlit account... You want to do this. Although I just deployed it, so I'm just showing you guys a simpler way. Okay. And then right here, you can also reboot and you can also delete as well. Before you do anything, you have, you have to connect your GitHub to your Streamlit account. Okay. Let's go to it. Detects a brain tumor. Here, I'll show you guys. Hold on a sec. Okay. Okay, and here we go. Okay. So, you see the tumor right there? Predicts a brain tumor. Of course, you guys remember that from this page, right? Okay, guys. I hope you learned from this video. And if you guys want to copy me, uh, let me know in the comments, and maybe I can uh, ma leave a link to my uh, GitHub. Okay, guys, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Share the video with anyone who's interested. Okay, guys, thank you.